Are you ready for a fun winter facts quiz? Hi, I'm also the polar bear and I have a challenge for you. What fun facts do you know about winter? Let's find out. Which animal makes mushroom jerky to eat during the winter? A bluebird? A red squirrel? Or a black bear? A red squirrel. Drying out meat or plants makes it last longer. That's what these squirrels are doing. Drying out mushrooms to make them last all winter. They hang them up until they are fully dry and ready to bring into their nests. Now that's being prepared. Where does the International Hair Freezing Contest take place every year? Finland? Germany? Or Canada? Canada. I am not sure why people want to freeze their hair, but here is how they do it. They sit in hot springs and get their hair wet. Then they shape it into wild patterns and designs as it freezes in the frigid air. <laughs> Would you try it? How many snowflakes fall to earth each year? A trillion? A billion? Or a septillion? A septillion. What is a septillion? <gasps> that is a lot of zeros. True or false? The biggest snowman ever built was just a few feet shorter than the Statue of Liberty. True! The tallest snowman in the world was actually a snow woman. She was built in Maine and stood 122 feet high. They had to use construction cranes to finish her. I guess she wasn't afraid of heights. True or false? An inch of rain in the summer is the same as an inch of snow in the winter. False. People often use the adjective fluffy to describe snow. That's because it has more air in it, making it softer with more volume. That means that an inch of rain is more than 10 inches of snow. So 10 inches of rain would be like 100 inches of snow. That might be too much snow, even for a polar bear like me. Which of the following countries is the world's coldest based on average temperature? France, Sweden, or Russia? Russia. The coldest place on earth can get as cold as negative 58 degrees Fahrenheit. It is a village in Russia that is very far away from other towns. I think those villagers might be part polar bears to live there. Can Niagara Falls freeze over? No? Or yes? No. Have you ever stepped onto a patch of ice only to find out it was super thin and only covered a puddle? Well, that is what happens with Niagara Falls. A thin crust of ice forms, so we can't see the water underneath, and it looks like the falls have stopped. It would be cool if they froze solid, though. Talk about a great ice slide. True or false, snowflakes take longer to reach the ground than raindrops. True. Raindrops usually head straight for the ground. Wind can move rain in different directions, but snow, because it is so much lighter than rain, can be easily pushed off course. It drifts and floats rather than taking the typical straight path of rain. What about you? Do you like to drift around like snow? Sounds peaceful to me. How many sides do most snowflakes have? Twelve? Six? Or five. Six. Snowflakes have six sides because the water molecules find it easier to join their atoms into a hexagon. I wonder how those molecules figured out what was easier. Those are some smart molecules. 
December temperatures in Australia are blank in the United States. The same as warmer than or colder than. Warmer than. In December, the Earth tilts away from the sun in the northern hemisphere. That means the southern hemisphere, where Australia is, tilts towards the sun. Colder to the sun equals warmer temperatures. I have always liked a cold December myself, but my kangaroo friends say they like their warm weather just fine. How did you do on my quiz? I hope you learned something new about my favorite season!